In this video, we're going to be using QuickBooks test company, Craig's Landscaping, to go through uh, how to navigate your way through QuickBooks so that I can show you what the different features are, where to find things, and how to get comfortable moving around within the software. So I'll put the link for this company below so that you can follow along. And the great thing about the sample company is that there's nothing that you can break. You can go in and create invoices or add accounts or do any number of tasks within the software. And it won't hurt a thing because it's a sample file and QuickBooks will update it back to its original. So when you click on the link for this file, the first thing it's going to bring up is the security verification um, where you need to tell us whether you're a robot or not. And I often wonder if I was a robot, what I should do. Like, can I not use the software? I don't know. I'm not sure what will happen. Okay, I'm gonna say I'm not a robot. All right, so here is the sample company. It is called Craig's Design and Landscaping Services. What we're looking at right here is called the home screen. Now, over on the left-hand side, we have what's called the left navigation bar. So if you hear me refer to something as the left navigation or the left nav, this is where I'm talking about. And this is going to show us a variety of different uh, tasky type things that we would be doing in the course of our accounting journey. Here on the home screen, we've got two different sections. We've got the get things done section and we've got the business overview section. So these are gonna give us two different pieces of information. This is the go here and do stuff piece of it. And then the business overview tab is going to give you some information about how things are going with your business. It's gonna show you bank accounts and invoices that are unpaid and expenses. It's gonna show you a bunch of um, valuable information that will be specific to your business. Now, if we come over here to this new plus new button right here, this is another spot where you can go to find the different transactions that you want to do. It's, it's meant to be like a quick shortcut. So if you wanna do a new invoice, you're gonna come over here under customers, click on invoice. If you wanna enter a new bill from a vendor, you're gonna, you can go right here. So these are tasks. This is not where you're gonna do anything with company setup. These are all going to be task related. So you wanna do a bank deposit, a transfer, you wanna do a journal entry. Those are all available in this part of the software, that plus new button. This is where you're gonna go most of the time. So the other important spot that you're gonna be looking at regularly will be this um, gear icon over here, and it is called a gear icon. So if you hear me call something a gear icon, that's where you wanna go. And over here, you're gonna find things that are more related to the setup of QuickBooks or changing preferences or a quick way to get to some specific things like lists, for example. So this is more setup, behind the scenes kind of stuff. And you're gonna go here occasionally. You'll go here when you set up a company or you wanna make a change, or if you wanna go quickly to look at a list for example, your products and services. And then you can also reconcile your bank accounts from here or enter a budget. So we're gonna go through each part of the software so that you understand where to find things, how things work, and what it means when you do certain things in QuickBooks. Like what does it mean when you enter a bill? What's going on behind the scenes? And that's gonna help you to understand it and to feel more confident using the software. So in the next few videos, we're going to dig into how the software is set up, how it works, and where to find things. So the next few videos are all about navigating your way through QuickBooks. So I will see you in the next video.